So what is going on YouTube? My name is Mehul and welcome to your fifth Chrome extension development tutorial in which we're gonna take a look at how we can actually modify or mess around with the user in real. So what we're gonna do is create a little extension which does some changes on the web and right now for this extension what we can do is actually get rid of all of this because we just need the content scripts in running. And what we have right here is that it matches every page on HTTP and HTTPS. And when that happens, I want the jQuery.js file to run. And after jQuery is ready, I want this my script to run so that we can actually make use of jQuery inside my script. Okay, so let's get started. So inside our my script, which is nowhere to be seen because I have changed the structure a little bit. If you see, I kind of removed those two extra folders which were redundant. So this is my script.js and what we're going to do is actually say that uh, um, on every page which there is an A, so I'm going to say on click function and I'm going to say alert you are about to go to and uh, I'm gonna say this dot attribute href and uh, I'm gonna say just send kind of this could irritate users right because if you are just getting an alert every time you are visiting somewhere it's kind of weird to act then okay so yeah that is it for our simple extension and if we take a look and if i reload this and it says me could not load okay i have uh, given up because i have changed the path and there we go we are alive again so if i reload this now and click on any link you see that it says me you are about to go to even pages just saying hit okay we go to even pages i click on another link and it's not really a link then or is it it is a data list item you're about to go to manifest just saying you're about to go to manifest just saying it's kind of weird and irritating but uh, that's how pretty much you can mess around with user for example you can say like uh, a dot uh, set or something like which has href value so add class this has got href and uh, you can say body body dot append style this has got href and actually you can do this with the style here inside content scripts as well but uh, I'm just gonna go with the jQuery one for now because it's relatively small so I'm gonna say and we can actually go ahead and use string literals why not and we can say something like well we have string literals now so we're gonna say color white and background black our favorite combination right so again if we reload hit enter and wait you can see we pretty much turn the page into some weird page and every link which has an href with it is changed so let's just find some link which does not so we take a look it's not a link at all and there's pretty much no link right here which does not have an href and I guess it does not have regular expression searching yet so yeah we just modified the page a little bit so yeah that's how pretty much you can mess around with a page and uh, change the UI according to your own wish so yeah that's all for this one and uh, if you liked it then don't forget to subscribe and in the next video we're gonna take a look at some more uh, realistic extension because you know this is kind of a weird extension to use 
So yeah, that's all for this one. And I'll see you then in the next one.